What up, guys? Uh, I had a few minutes, or a little, I had a little bit before my parenting class tonight, and uh, so I thought I'd bring you another review. Now, yesterday I posted a picture up on EP of me wearing a uh, wolf head, wolf head hair styling pomade, and uh, you guys kind of liked it a lot. Um, the shine on this shit is just crazy. So what I want to do is I want to show it out to you guys. So this is wolf head, all the way from Montreal, Canada, brewed by a lady named uh, Claire Carney. She used to do south side shaving, or south side soaps, but uh, now she does wolf head. She's got a whole line of grooming supplies, uh, shampoos, conditioners, she's coming out with a grooming spray, and uh, but what I got is the pomade, and there's a big thing on e one of the Facebook groups about uh, showing off the tins in your reviews, and I don't really do that, you know, I'll show you a picture, of, you know, whatever, but uh, one thing I really like about this tin is the traditional you know, kind of tattoo art styling of a wolf's head on the top. I just wanted to give a quick shout out to that because that's, that's pretty fucking cool. Uh, anyways, wolf head pomade all the way from Montreal, Canada. And uh, I thought it was from France, but it's not. Anyways, got my hair coconut oiled, blow dried. This pomade, nice natural color. Now the thing about this stuff is it scoops out uh, kind of tough, right? And it kind of breaks apart all like that. It is all natural, it's vegan, it's uh, I know it's wax based, but that's, that's about it, all natural vegan. You know, but when you break it down, this shit just turns to fucking, it melts. It basically just melts. And in 2.5 seconds you got basically just a load of shine in your hands. Now the hold on it is rather light. I'd say it'd go best as a topper, uh, rather than a standalone product. I don't like doing toppers that much. I just like wearing the standalone and uh, testing out its abilities. But this stuff, it's not too difficult to break out. It's, it, but it, it's got some pressure. But then melting it down is just nothing. So it has a really nice, subtle uh, scent. It's described as spicy and sweet, and I definitely see that. What I'm getting when I put it in my hair is. Uh, like uh, like chai tea, you know, it's it's spicy and kind of you can smell that it's spicy but also creamy or sweet. It smells exactly like chai tea, which is pretty cool. Um, it's not a bad thing to smell all day. It, it's subtle but it, it lasts. It really does. And all day you just get little whiffs of this creamy spicy scent that's pretty damn good. Uh, let's do one more scoop. Like I said, it's a lighter prod or lighter product. It's marketed as a versatile medium. You can pick it up on hedgeline.com. I believe that's the only place right now. And, uh, but it, it's really just a, a light. You know, with, with all natural and vegan, most of them at least, it's, it's usually a lighter hold with a higher shine. And uh, yeah, my hair's pretty sticky. I feel it everywhere. Start styling. Styling with it is Pretty simple as well, because combing is nothing, right? Your comb just glides through your hair. And uh, for the most part, you can get it where you want. You know, you can get your hair styled how you like it. It just, I mean, the hold is just kind of lacking a little bit. I don't know how many times I can say that right now. But yeah. Get that nice part right there. I really like that I kind of found uh, a more natural part. Again, I'm not sure if it is my natural part, but my hair seems to like it and it'll just fall that way now. And it looks a lot better. So if you have trouble with your part, you know, just fuck around with it. Maybe talk to a barber, maybe figure it out yourself. Try to find maybe your part's a little higher up. Uh, you know, it, if, if you work with your hair, your hair's gonna work with you, I found out. and. You can, you can talk to Jonathan about it. He's the master of this natural part thing. His part's like way up here. And he rocks it, dude. He fucking rocks it. So as you can see, this stuff is crazy shiny. Crazy shiny. And uh, I don't know if it's because it's all natural or you know what. Maybe it's because it's a lighter hold. But fucking shine city. Over there.
And like I said, for the most part, you can get your hair doing what you want. This isn't what I want my hair to do. It's just not going to stay. It's not going to hold if you want height, if you want whatever. Yesterday I did kind of a bigger uh, part up front and it just, it didn't stay. I, had to, I, I changed it up like three times throughout the day, just every time I comb. Eh. I got this really wavy hair that, you know, it might look good now, but it's going to fucking break. And it'll be wavy and it'll look like poo poo. So I changed it up quite a bit throughout the day. But look at that, styling is easy, it's a breeze, uh, I mean it's a light product, it's nice. Now is that too big? Is that too motherfucking pride rock? A lot of people say that my hair looks like the big rock from Lion King. Whatever man. I'll go low, I'll go low today, how about that? Look at that, nice, nice small pump, uh, shiny as shit. Now what's awesome about this is because it's all natural, vegan, all that good stuff, when you wash your hair out, your hair feels like fucking silk. I, I wore this yesterday and I washed it out this morning and my all day I was just feeling my hair. It's like, it's like almost 3.30 now, I just got home from work and took a shower to get my hair right and now I'm doing it up for this parenting class I got tonight. Um, by the way, congratulations Jacob. Jacob and his wife Emily just had a beautiful baby girl today actually. Uh, today is Monday. I probably won't post this till tomorrow. Um, but congratulations Jacob. Proud of you. I'm next, hopefully. <laughs> um, so yeah, anyways, this stuff uh, feels like silk when you wash it out and it's really super conditioning and nourishing because of all the all natural products in it. It does have the ingredients, soy wax, avocado oil, candelilla wax, organic coconut oil, castor oil, castor latum, aloe butter, cocum butter, and fragrance. So just really good healthy stuff for your hair. Now what I'm going to do, because I didn't put any balm in my beard right now, I'm just going to take a good, good dollop of uh, wolf head and condition the shit out of my beard. Mm. Got that spicy, sweet chai tea scent. Definitely smell that all day. It's gonna be shiny. Have a little bit of hold for you. Great beard product. Great beard balm. Let's see. Ah. Comb that in. Okay, maybe I didn't put enough in for the shine and all that, but you get the point. Boom, look at that. Ready to go, eight minutes. Not bad. All right, guys. Uh, hopefully, you're getting your products off Hedgeline, entering my Instagram name, getting a free Mogard. If you do, take a picture of that Mogard and send it to me on Instagram or Facebook or wherever. Let me see that you got it. Uh, hopefully, you've already subscribed to my channel, liked my videos, posted up comments saying, hey, what's up? You know, I really appreciate it when you guys do. Make sure you keep doing that. Um, said it before, I'll say it again, once I reach 500 subscribers, I will do another drunk video. Um, pomade of your choice, as long as I have the pomade. So it could be one that I've already reviewed. Uh, yeah, you know. Cool, say, so, you know, post a comment, say hey, subscribe to my channel, like my video, you guys are always awesome, as, and you're the best, and I love you all. And uh, Jacob, congratulations, man. Peace.